John. Yeah, don't go Thank over you there. very much. Thank you very much, everybody. Boop, boop, boop. Thank you all over there. Hey, listen, John. I hold in my hands the hot little cards here with the questions on them. Mm -hmm. uh, not that I'm going to need them because these yeah. two people are just a delight just to jaw with. Yes. The, the lovely and talented America Ferrera is going to be out here in yes. just a little bit. And, and then, but first, we're going to have uh, your friend, Adam Driver, is going to yes. be out here in just one moment. Y'all yeah, know each other from back great, to the Juilliard great days. Great friend of mine. Yes, indeed. Yeah, that's lovely. Um, uh, folks, all across the country, Families are gathering together to celebrate this special time of the year. The WWE Survivor Series <laughs> happening this Sunday here in New York. And I have so many questions like, who will take home the title? And will someone get hit with a folding chair? Or will they up the stakes and use a lazy boy? <laughs> and I'm not the only one with questions. I think everyone here at The Late Show would love to ask just one question of the biggest WWE superstars, like Randy Orton. Seth Rollins, Bianca Belair, Becky Lynch, The Street Profits, Big E, and The Miz. So, we let my staff do just that. This is The Late Show's Just One Question, WWE Edition. What's your favorite part about being in WWE? I get to beat girls up and lift them over my head and get paid while I do it. There is nothing quite like entering an arena and having 10,000 people chant, you suck. If you could fight anybody in the world, who would you pick? I would fight George Clooney. Maybe Cruella DeVille. Ooh, and this is gonna blow everybody's mind. I think I would fight myself. Hey, Big E, do you think I can get as big as you? Of course you can. It's mostly positivity and optimism. You're going to want at least 70 pounds of positivity. <clears throat> I've been watching a long time, and I've always wondered, why do they call it a ring when it's a square? That's a, that's a good question. Whoa. You just made me work out the most important muscle of all. The bicep. What's the most painful hold you've ever experienced? Right now. I've been on hold for 45 minutes with the damn cable company. Seth Rollins, I heard that when you travel, you always bring your championship belt with you on the plane. Why? Well, how else am I supposed to keep up my championship pants? My question is for Street Profits. I noticed that you spell profit with an F, like money. So do you have any financial advice for people? Yeah. <laughs> Stop talking about Bitcoin. Yeah, just stop. Just stop talking about it. Please! Randy Orton, they call you the Viper. Is that because of your killer instincts? No. It's because I'm a parcel moth. Huh, really? I would have never guessed it. Classic Ravenclaw. <laughs> what music gets you pumped up before a WWE match? Nah. I love heavy metal after a match, but before a match, I only listen to Bob Dylan's Christmas album. It's so weird. It makes me really angry. Hey, Becky, this guy wants to know if it hurts to get hit by a steel chair. Oh, wow, I guess it does hurt. Bianca Belair, I love when you use your long braid to whip people, but I've always wondered, is it real? Not only is it real, it has a mind of its own. Check it out. Ooh. There she is. There she is. There she is. Ooh, she likes you. Oh. Huh? Hey there. You working on any of your finishing moves? Yeah, I got this new one called the Gut Buster, where I serve them an entire Thanksgiving meal, and I wait for them to take a nap so I can pin them. I'm bringing all the fixings! <laughs> Thank you, WWE. Survivor Series streams live this Sunday on Peacock and WrestleMania 38 tickets are on sale now. We'll be right back with Adam Driver.